hello. Hello, Ujima. My name is Miss Saldana, and I am your new art teacher. I am so excited to be a part of this team. And because of our circumstances, we can't meet in person just yet, but we're gonna use Google Classrooms and um, video, as well as photography, to help us make some artwork, express our ideas, raise some questions, and also learn some new skills. So this questionnaire is designed for you to tell me a little bit about yourself, what your goals and aspirations are, what are some of your talents, and then I want you to tell me a little bit about what art materials you have around your house that we can work with. And finally, you're gonna be submitting a video of your own telling me about who you are and showing me some of your artwork if you have any or a talent that you have so that this way I can get to know you and it's gonna help me build really strong lessons that focus on who you are and what you care about. Um, a little bit about me. So I have some artwork here that I wanna tell you about. I'm an artist. This here is a tree and it, um, I did this when I was about 19, 18 years old. I had just moved out of my home in Miami, Florida I moved to Baltimore to study art at the Maryland Institute College of Art. So this tree made me really sad because it was standing upright once and trees are normally up and down, right? But this tree was side to side, it was horizontal. And I did a series of drawings where I was thinking about horizontality and that sometimes in life when things are horizontal, and it, 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 it can mean death. So for me, this was a symbol of not death, but of the end of my childhood and entering into adulthood, which can be a scary time, but a very important time that set the path for my career. This here is a sign that is G-A-L-L, -L, which is a letter in Spanish, O-P-I-N-T-O. And I made this all myself by hand using wood, aluminum, and um, Christmas lights. Um, this sign is a marquee and it pays tribute to who I am. It's a self-portrait. While it doesn't have my face and body, it has um, a lot of symbolism in it. It has the color of the wood, which is kind of a pale color, the color of my skin, but it also has a trim, if you see around it, of dark red and that's the color of kidney beans. Kidney beans are really important in my culture and in Nicaragua in Central America we eat beans a lot. We mostly eat beans with white rice and when we mix it together it looks like a painted chicken and if you break down this word in Spanish pinto means paint or Latin rather and then gallo g-a-l-l-o gallo is chicken. So painted chicken um, is what this dish looks like, gallo pinto. This is a word that I relate to and I wanted to make a sign because I see myself in this word and sometimes when we don't see ourselves in society, art can be a really strong way to tell people who you are and what's important to you, especially when you talk about your identity and your culture. Very, very important. So I wanted to let you know that I have taught K through 12th grade, I have taught college, I have taught undergrad and graduate students. My favorite time is working with middle school students because this is a really important time in your life where you are full of ideas and passion and you are trying to make sense of the world and making very big decisions right now that are gonna impact the rest of your life. And I am honored to be a part of this journey with you. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to let you know that for the past 12 years, I have been working here in Baltimore with nonprofit organizations and different schools, church groups, to build programs that bring people together. Programs like films, exhibitions, um, creating small businesses for women, um, sharing a lot of Latin American culture here in Baltimore, as well as African American culture and traditions, um, as well as Middle Eastern culture and traditions. So that's a little bit about my work as an arts administrator. But the part I enjoyed the most was working with students and working in schools for K through 12th grade. 
So I'm so excited I can focus all of my time on just working with you, our students. Who else? Okay, so I think that's all I have for now. You're gonna be filling out a questionnaire and the questionnaire is just gonna help me figure out what art materials you have around your house that we can use, as well as what your interests are, what your talents are, what your goals and aspirations are. At the end, you're gonna be making a short video about, you know, under six minutes like this one and telling me about who you are. Show me your face, take your time, take a deep breath, and maybe show me some artwork or a talent that you have. I hope you enjoy, and if you have any questions, you can always email me or call me. I'll be making calls this week and next week to get to know you a little bit better. Well, I'm Miss Aldana, and I look forward to getting to know you. Have a great day.